TLE6 Agriculture Different ways on how to care for seedlings Objectives At the end of 50 minutes, 100% of the learners are expected to Identify the different ways on how to care for seedlings Demonstrate ways on how to care for seedlings Enumerate the different ways on how to care for seed The beginning growth of a seed is called germination or sprouting wherein a root is grown first to establish itself to the ground to produce its food, then, continue to grow and develop organs. Caring of seeds begins in selection up to storing them. Proper selection of seeds. Seeds must come from mature fruits or nearly mature fruits for seedlings. Seed must have good germinating capacity. Collect seed only from healthy, vigorous trees with good form, and quality growth. Seed should be free from mixture of weed seeds. Avoid picking from isolated naturally cross-pollinating species of trees because they are of low viability. Seeds must be free from damage or diseases. Seeds covered with pulp or with fruit juice must be washed. Dry good seeds quickly under the sun. Testing of seeds. Plant growers can determine the germinating ability of the seeds before testing them. Testing seeds before planting also prevents wasted of good seeds or avoids the need to plant again. Storing of seeds. The life of the seed must be ensured when storing it. Humidity is the important factor causing deterioration of the vitality of the seeds when stored at room temperature. 
In case the seeds are stored at room temperature, it should not be stored in a sealed container except when the moisture content is reduced. Reminders in storing seeds In using desiccants, remember to use a container with tight cover. Place only the desiccants at the bottom part with a punched hold cardboard on top. Place the seeds on top of the cardboard or in an envelope with proper labeling. In cold temperature storing, put dry seeds in a bottle or jar with tight cover and store only in the low or cold temperature. Examine the bottled seeds without opening them once a month and check for possible fungi or insect infestation.